Good morning, class. My name is Lindsay Birding, and today I'll be presenting on Karl Mannheim's concept of particular and total ideologies. As a sociologist, Mannheim was interested in describing how people interpret the world around them based on interest, culture, and societal position. Uh, he distinguished between two types of ideologies, particular and total. Particular ideologies are representations of things in the world around us that can be colored by point of view. Total ideologies are entire ways of thinking that color the way we see the world around us. Um, both of these concepts assert that interpretations, values, and thoughts reflect societal position. The main difference between the two is that particular ideologies only relate to part of an opponent's assertions, uh, works mainly with interests, and the point of reference is always the individual. With total ideologies, an opponent's entire worldview is called into question. Parties have fundamentally different worldviews, and the very foundations of their thinking differ. The reference point is always the underlying structure of a single judgment. My modern-day example of this was political views um, with myself and my husband and my stepfather. Um, my husband and I have similar experience and come from a similar background. We've both had to live with lower than livable wages, unaffordable daycare, unaffordable health insurance, which has caused both of us to have um, a pretty liberal view. Uh, we lean mostly to the left. My husband, however, works in the oil field, um, which colors his point of view on global warming and switching to renewable energy. <clears throat> so that's my example of particular ideologies. For total ideologies, I thought of my stepfather, who is a Vietnam veteran, Catholic, self-made man. He's made quite a um, he's a self-made man in land developing, and his views are extremely conservative. And when we start talking politics, there is no way to reach an agreement. So that's just made me think of him. My questions for you are: Mannheim differentiated between two types of ideologies. What were they? Partial and complete, particular and total, or practical and nonsense? The answer is B, particular and total. My next question is, which element did Mannheim believe was the function of society? A, what a person thinks. B, what a person values. C, what a person interprets. Or D, all of the above. And the answer is D, all of the above. Thank you for listening to my presentation. Have a great day.